We are interrupting this live stream for an important announcement from Wolf King customers. Oh, hey. I didn't see you over there. I guess I'm seeing you now. I heard the intro music, so I think it's time for me to make a message recording to you little purple gang gangs if you didn't know who this was it's me the len the wolf king the real wolf king not the fake rollerblade in parkour jumping wolf king real wolf king len laguardia i'm over here in new jersey i watched the show from saturday night i can't get over what i see i can't get over it you guys went all you guys you guys pushed it too far you pushed it way too far. You killed off my favorite character. I haven't seen that happen in forever. It makes me so sad. Little Billy, Billy Beige, Billy Bayou, Billy, Billy Bobkins, Billy Bobka. My little Billy, my little Billy gone. This better be a joke. A joke that you guys are playing, you Scooby-Doo wizard and your little puby beard red man. You guys better be just playing around because I don't I don't want to not see my little buddy Billy Boochka again. I got a long history with Billy over the years. I love that little guy. He's always ready to help me. He takes care of things for me, teaches me how to wrestle alligators when I go to his little dojo, swamp dojo. Never taught me the tickle tickle secrets, but he taught me a lot. To you, Billy. God rest your soul, my little friend. As a tribute to you, Billy, I am going to wear a special death mask. It's an old tradition until the period of mourning is over and then the mask can be removed. But until then, I shall wear it for every public appearance so no one can look upon the sorrow of my face and feel the sorrow that I feel. You know, I have the death mask preparing over here in the fires. I, I got it in the forge. It's kind of like getting ready for me. So if you don't mind, I'm going to go over there and see how it's doing. Walking noise, walking noise, walking noise. It's hot. Oh, I put it on too hot. Oh, it's burning my face. Oh, the Billy Death Mask burned me. Oh, the agony. The agony is too much. Oh. Origin story, origin story, origin story. <laughs> hey everybody um it's day three since old billy passed um it's just been kind of sad here in the ackerman house um i have really hadn't told too many people this but the whole you know billy and his critters hustling every day my dog buddy wanted to be one of those little critters. He kind of aspired to hustle, to, you know, be part of some sort of, you know, MLM or, or you know, one of those schemes that Billy does all the time. And, and now, you know, he'll never have his opportunity. It's like, here, just take a look for yourself. He hasn't eaten. He's not, he's not as active as normal. This, this is him for the last three days. Listen, I was never one of the people that was like dying to get Glumpy back um, and, and all that. Um, but I mean, this is old Billy. This is our correspondent in the South. He's an inspiration to, you know, people that live in trailer parks and, and animals that want to be part of some sort of money-making scheme. Oh, Billy, you always had one crazy scheme after another, and your tenacity was to be admired. But uh, if only it had been matched with some common sense. But uh, now you're gone. 
I mean, I guess we knew this would eventually happen. And, uh, you know, if only your common sense matched your tenacity. It doesn't seem fair. Worse yet is the people you left behind. Like, what's going to happen to Jersey now? Did you think of that? Did you? Oh, Billy. May you rest in peace. <laughs> Holy Lord, Gerard, we killed Billy again. Hello there, it's your guy, Ken Poole. The uh, producers asked me to come on and uh, say a few words about our uh, our friend, Southern correspondent, oh, Billy. Uh, Billy, I'm currently on three hustles right now because uh, of your inspiration, all your great works. Wherever you are, Billy, I hope, uh, I hope you found that final hustle. Hey, Purple Gang Gang. Old Billy here. Uh, last week, uh, got a little awkward. Got a little awkward, not gonna lie. Got a little awkward. Those uh, construction workers, uh, they were a little upset about the uh, the gasoline that uh, we had procured. But at any rate, uh, yeah, what, y'all thought old Billy was dead? Come on now. I just pulled a trick that Lester taught me and I played possum. I knew that those rednecks were still going to be upset and I couldn't be bouncing around the bayou. What? You think I'm going to miss Legion's Con 2024? No. That's why I've been hustling all year. That's right. Jeremy Girard promised us it would be a buying experience like none other. You think Billy's going to miss that? Hell no. So I'm just going to cool my heels down here in my, my, you know, my bunker until it's time for me to head on out to Legion's Con. So, uh, yeah. See y'all at Legion's Con. Billy Beige, out. Man, I tell you one thing. Next time I make one of these escape bunkers, I'm going to be sure to get some indoor plumbing.